Welcome planner friends. This is Jan with Jan Happy Planning. Thank you for joining me for another video today. I have for you a uh, plan with me uh, on my big um, indigo um, vertical layout and I will be doing um, today is the 7th so I will be doing the 8th to the 14th of November and um, I have fallen behind, unfortunately, on my, um, well, it's not really unfortunately, um, I know what I did. And today is Sunday, so um, it's before lunch, so um, I should be all right for the things that I need to do. So this is my uh, layout at the moment. Uh, as you know, I'm using the... Uh, what's it called again? Why do I always forget things? Um, the Miss Maker, that's right. The Miss Maker um, checklist um, extension pack. And um, I have already uh, dated it and I will, I will leave th certain things. Um, I, I'm not sure about this uh, pair of scissors, but um, I will not blank out a lot so for my spread i am going to uh, use poppies and because the uh let me just put this aside the um the 11th in uh, in europe we celebrated uh, we celebrate uh remembrance day and remember, uh, remember, Remembrance Day is to celebrate those who have fallen in the horrors of war. More specifically, uh, World War One. But since then, we have had a few. So this is not for me to uh, lecture or anything. But in my spread, I want to celebrate not only those who went to fight. Because, yes, some people went to fight, but those who were left behind also suffered that. So it's also to commemorate that to togetherness that, especially when we have a family member uh, that has to go to war. Anyway, so um, I couldn't find many poppies. <laughs> Or so I thought, but this, for example, comes from Garden Flowers, I believe. So these are the only true poppies, um, papaves, that I found that were explicitly poppies. Now, I went on um, a search and this I got from, um, I'm going to show you here, um, Live Love Porsche, Floral Blossoms. I believe this was her first book. Uh, I got some from here. And I think another page, but yeah, they, they are more, but they are not. I have a few reds and I, and I will show you. <laughs> I will also have to probably stop at some point because I need to get my poppy. I have a poppy that I had for donkey's ears uh, which is the one that uh, we wear on on our lapels or clothes so i then these are the uh, the live love Porsche here this one's this is happy planner this is happy planner i went on to um, my um, this came with uh, i can't remember it i think it was the um it was a, a big happy box that contained this um, create your own sticker uh, pack and it had these um, florals uh, for coloring or was on the side anyway so I put this all of them here and these are the only ones that I find that look like a poppy now these come which are the same as this come from um, sophisticated florals 
um, so I'm going to show you. I left some here. Um, this is um, in sort of rose gold uh, foil, but they also have uh, in black outline and in sort of uh, coral blush color, and then some big ones as well. So I went, I went around and I found a few more. This one I colored. It's uh, it's not bad. I'll show you there. So I went with um, my future color brush pens. I'll show you, and it did a job. Now I think it's slightly. Yeah, it's going to come off, so I probably will not use that because you can see and it's going to transfer to the previous page. So I will not be using that one, unfortunately, even though I love um, I love what I did there, but it's not going to hold. The one on this side, yeah, it also transfers, is um, this green is um, my Tombow. And it also comes off. It's the the clear sticker paper uh, repels the ink because obviously it's not made for it. That said, I found this sheet. This is from Create with Mandy. And even though it says florals, and I went to her Etsy shop, Etsy shop because that's where I bought it. It does not have the name Poppy in it, but to me, they look like poppies, so I colored them in red because I need them to be red. And that's what I'm going to use now that I know that I will not be able to use these ones. I might, but I might not because I quite like the fact that it's color and I still have these ones that I have colored already. And they are actually three sheets, so I will have six in total of these ones. It's the same ink, but because these ones have uh, gray lines and it has shedded a little bit of the ink, um, it picked up, the brush picked up a little bit of that dark ink um, because it's not meant for coloring uh, this sticker paper, but I will still use it. So I'm just going to transfer these ones. I don't know whether I want to use these little bits at this time. A moment in time but I'm going to leave them and I'm going to go I haven't I do have a sort of um, it ripped a bit so we need to fix that um, an idea of what I want It bled through. And this is uh, meant for coloring, but probably not all inks. Um, I had an idea when I was in bed, uh, but I do not know anymore. Let's see how this pans out. But I'm really looking forward to creating this theme on my. Um, on my planner so I'm just going to put this aside and we're going to start so I have this wavy um, grid on a white background I have Spotty Dotty from uh, uh, According to Ali, that's gold, that's gold. And I do have this one, and there are some poppies in there, um, which is also from Ali. So this actually might be uh, an excellent alternative. Mm, I don't think I have anything else that could help. 
this spread at this moment in time so i'm going to put these two aside on in view even though sometimes they're in front of me but i don't see them and i'm going to start with this one so the idea was to make a cascade of poppies now the thing is that i have very different sizes even though I lost these ones. Um, I'm going to stop the video because I just had an idea and I will back uh, I will be back with you in a jiffy. So I had an idea of transferring um, one of the um, this one um, probably can't see. It. One of these ones into white sticker paper that has been already brushed with uh, some ink and then place the sticker on top the problem is that it doesn't have an outline anymore um so yeah i think if i had a um an acrylograph in red that would work but i don't have one and this is um it's not the right color. Um, it's quite, it's orange. But then I have this one in orange. Um, I am going to try this out. Um, here in front of you but i will speed it up um as not to there's quite a little bit of outline there so i don't know how i know that mary ellen has done it and i think planning with with elise um Elise um, has also done it. Um, she's very good friends with Mary Ellen. I miss her. Um, so I think in my work, um, I'm not sure whether Mary Ellen has done or not. Maybe she has and I can't remember anymore. Uh, clear I know she has done on paper so I'm going to leave a bit of I won't speed this up because it's not going to take long and I will put it aside to dry Because this one I let it dry and it just didn't work. Um, or maybe it needs a lot more to work. I still have quite a bit of ink in my uh, hands. So I'm going to... Yeah, it picked up a bit more ink. I can see because my, um, my fingers there. So this is the one that I have just done with uh, my acrylograph uh, in orange. So, uh, because this is slightly orangey, and this is also a different color, um, we'll see, we'll see, because these are smaller, so I can, I can use that. I don't know whether I will be able to recover um, this one, but I could go, and it, I'll do it off camera, I could go right to the uh, outline and cut it there. So as I said, I wanted a cascade from the 11th. So I think what I'm going to do is do the entire uh, length of um, my spread at the bottom. Because I want to again do a cascade of Poppies, but which ones do I want to wear? I think 
I want these guys here, but I'm going to cut the bottom uh, that has a little bit of uh, white outline. Careful that it doesn't go on top of this thing. So we're going to do, I'm going to cut this I'm loving it. I'm loving it. Um, I know that this looks weird here. I do. So I'm not sure how to fix it. I will probably sort of, I don't know. I'll see. I'll see. I'll see what happens. Um, I'm actually lifted. I think I'm going to lift it. Uh, okay, surgery. Stick a surgery. This guy is still drying, so I think it's going to work. Yeah, that's going to work. So um, what I'm going to do is not to elongate this. Um, um, video because i know i know i make long videos <laughs> i'm going to color these guys and lift this guy and then i'll be back with you hi everyone i'm back um so i have colored um with my acrylograph um i have color um these three as well as this one which is this sort of gray um, but it hasn't worked really well but I don't know whether I want to use it anymore. And I have also um, colored the rest of uh, uh, Mandy's stickers and um, I re removed this guy from here. I might actually put it on this side, I don't know yet. Um, I'm going to fill this gap and I will leave a, um, a space for uh, a box that will contain Remembrance Day. Um, so I'm just going to, I found this guy stuck to something else, so I do have this one, but I think I'm going to cut these little bits. I need to still color those around there. And there was some ink transfer that was picked up from my um, mittens. So um, here and here. 
Um, so yes. And let's see how we're going to do this. We might actually put this one here because we have this cut here. So we can put it upside down and put this one here. It has quite a bit of white, so I need to cut that out. Okay, I kind of like very much my little, um, I thought I wanted this up here, but then I don't have enough space for my box. Um, so I'm thinking to maybe place it here, but I'm going to, again, uh, cut the little bits. And one more, and I just got a cut here in there. And so, um what I will do very lightly is go over the clear ones with my bone folder. Yeah, that makes that works perfectly uh, to flatten the um, the bubbles out. So the um, the sticker, the actual design comes through. So I'm back with um, finishing off. I just went to have a little lunch because I was starting to shake. So um, this is uh, where I got um, some of these flowers. Actually, I think I don't think I'll do any more because the uh, the ones I uh, I use the poppy like are um, they're not anymore or with an accent. So I don't know whether I want to use these boxes. They're a bit pale. I do love these ones. I think they're so pretty, but I could. But since I already have the checklist, I am not going to use that. Instead, I'm going to see what of the red ones I have. I don't think I have many red ones. I may use some greens if I still have some that can be used. Hey friends, I'm back. Um, okay, so I gathered some more boxes, colorful boxes, uh, jungle vibes and colorful boxes and more jungle vibes and more colorful boxes and I got this from I think it's a botanical yes from Live Love Porsche in case I need more greens um, so I have um, overlay this you are beautiful this is the other side of it which I don't need that's from uh, um, jungle vibes and I'm going to bring this quite up here I think because I want to leave as well a little bit of space and I want to um, get rid of that um, 
quotes there that says notes crafty plan sorry uh, you still see it okay so i'm going to get my cheapo um white out and yeah it's stop working oh it's so annoying i'm just going to do it that way and then like so so it it should be all right so you are beautiful every day so um i found a quote um that says let love grow i think i want to put it here but having said that i have this page that uh where can i do it let's do it here i want to see if i do it like so okay just imagine, just imagine, I'm just trying to get my feel, I work better with this one. Because I didn't find a specific quote for what I want to say. So let love grow. not war but maybe just having that word there it thro throws me off a bit so I will probably just leave it as let love grow um, and that I want to put here because we have the poppies um, at the bottom, which are the poppies that I didn't want to use in the middle there. So I will get rid of the bubbles a little later. And I want a box here that can say remembrance. Now, I'm not sure whether I'm not even sure that that's going to uh, fit in that box, in that specific box, because I write so big and I do have another box of this size and I probably have another box that is even bigger. So that's okay. Um, I could place this one here and get rid of the um, elephant so I could do it that way Yeah, I like that. Um, I just, I lost Mandy here. I think it'll be too much. Again, this is stays one, but I haven't lifted from this side, so no, it's not going to work. 
Okay, so um, let's do something else with those boxes. So I will write here remembrance now. I need to control my handwriting because it's such a long word. That's what I could do, which is the same as um, the monthly Remembrance Day. I didn't make a mistake. I was sweating buckets, actually. Um, so, yeah, I love my spread. That's what I want. I do want also to place a couple of um, boxes here and there. So I'm going to mix and match. And these two, these three go together because they like each other. Okay. So um, let's do green and this one. And then we have, we can put the red one here. And there's this other red one that needs to have something. Uh, Mandy's sticker is here. I could only. I could overlay this way. Actually, on top, this can go on top. Okay, um, I don't know that I don't like this one. It's a bit funny. So, and I don't have any more poppies. I think I saw a couple, but it's not worth going through the trouble. So, um, Actually, let's take some of these ones because the greens should be very similar because it comes from the same designer, which is Live Love Bosch. We can bring this dark one up here.
It's a bit old. That's a little bit better and um, let's do this dark one here. This we can do like that. And a few things that I can uh, and to finish off let's put this box here underneath the poppy slightly more to the bottom sorry if you can't see my hair it's not intentional Okay, so I have a sort of flow there, and then this one here. It's Mrs. One, another little one. Let's see if I have. Yes, we have these ones that I use for. It's the same color as this, slightly darker. For some reason it's slightly darker but it's it's not too dissimilar to the ones found in the poppies so no I think I want to slightly, not slightly, but white this out. Let's see whether it works. That's enough. And I think it works. And I think that is it. Uh, guys, I am just going to um, come back with the punched um, spread and... I will say goodbye to you. See you in a minute. So here is my spread um, on my desks. And now I'm just uh, finishing off uh, the last touch, uh, touches, uh, which is um, bits of washi, um, again, um, watercolor florals uh, from uh, uh, Ali, from According to Ali and this is just the um, latest purchase from uh, Lidl that I got this um, set of four, four or five washies, which I thought they were beautiful. I'm just going to, I think I'm going to take it all the way. I think I will probably rip this sideways and um, leaving a little bit of the red there overlapping the green you can still see it and I think I will just stop a bit further than this box and then I have already uh, torn watercolor florals which has the um, a little bit of the uh, and this one also will stretch a bit beyond this one is upside down maybe I should put it this way yeah that's better I think so this one can go 
all the way to this edge. Let's see whether I can tear it. Yeah, sometimes it doesn't tear if it's a tiny, tiny piece. So I think that's my last touch. Um, I'm running out of battery now. So um, yeah, I, I went away, but then I decided to come back because I thought that this washi here was not enough. So I think um, now I'm happy and I'm just going to take slightly a little bit into this um, poppies here and then do the rip at an angle and I think I can bring back the design underneath by flattening it a bit and get rid of any air bubbles. So okay, I am done now for sure. This is my spread for this coming week, starting tomorrow, Monday the 8th of November. Thank you so much for watching. Please like, subscribe and comment below what you think of this spread. Hit the notification bell for when my next video comes up and I will see you on my next one. Take very good care of yourselves and happy planning. Bye!